Who was General Bernard Elliott B. Jr.? Bernard Elliott B. Jr. was a career United States Army officer and a Confederate States Army general during the American Civil War. He was mortally wounded at the First Battle of Bull Run, one of the first general officers to be killed in the war. During that battle, he was responsible for inspiring the famous nickname for Brigadier General Thomas J. Stonewall Jackson. B. was born in Charleston, South Carolina on February 8, 1824. He was the son of Bernard and Ann B. His mother's perennial line also included French ancestry. In 1833, the B. family moved to Pendleton, South Carolina, where the Junior B. attended the Pendleton Academy. In 1836, B's parents moved to Texas, which had achieved independence as the Republic of Texas. B remained in Pendleton, living with his mother's three sisters, to pursue his education. B graduated from the United States Military Academy on July 1, 1845, 33rd in his class of 41 and assigned as a brevet second lieutenant to the 3rd U.S. Infantry Regiment. He accumulated many demerits while at West Point, including several for chewing tobacco while on duty. B's first posting was to serve in the United States military occupation of Texas during the Mexican-American War. He was twice breveted for gallantry in the war. B was posted after the war to garrison duty at Pascagoula, Mississippi, where he served as adjutant. From 1849 to 1855, he was on frontier duty in New Mexico. He was stationed primarily at Fort Fillmore near Las Cruces, New Mexico. In 1855, B was promoted to captain of Company D of the 10th Infantry and posted to Fort Snelling, Minnesota. While at Fort Snelling, he met and married Sophie Elizabeth Hill, the sister of a fellow officer. In 1857, B's company took part in the Utah War. He was placed in command of the Utah Volunteer Battalion and breveted to the rank of Lieutenant Colonel. In 1860, B was posted to Fort Laramie, Wyoming, where he briefly served as the fort's commanding officer. B served as best man at the wedding of his West Point classmate, Nathan G. Evans. Upon the start of the Civil War, B, like many Army officers from the South, was torn between loyalty to his home state or to the Federation of the United States. He struggled with the decision but opted to stay with the South. On March 3, 1861, B resigned from the United States Army and returned to Charleston, where he was elected Lieutenant Colonel of the 1st South Carolina Regulars. On June 17, 1861, B was appointed Brigadier General of a brigade mobilized at Manassas Junction, although he was confirmed by the Confederate Senate posthumously. He was given command of the 3rd Brigade of the Army of the Shenandoah 
under Brigadier General Joseph E. Johnson. During the subsequent battle, later known as the First Battle of Bull Run, on July 21, 1861, B. is said to have used the term Stonewall in reference to Brigadier General Thomas J. Jackson and his men giving rise to the name Stonewall Jackson and his Stonewall Brigade. B. was wounded in the stomach by a Union artillery shell and after considerable suffering died the next day. He is buried at St. Paul's Episcopal Church Cemetery in Pendleton, South Carolina. As a result, it could not be determined whether his naming of Stonewall Jackson was intended as praise a condemnation, or whether it was simply a misattributed quote. B. was the younger brother of Hamilton P. B., who was also a Confederate Army Brigadier General and the brother-in-law of Confederate Brigadier General Clement H. Stevens.